Hey guys, this is CoolBro458, and today I am back with another tutorial video. My last video was how to update to the iOS 9.3 beta, <clears throat> which is which is not available to the public. And today I will be showing you how to install plugins on a plug pocket mine server. A lot of people have been asking, how do you get a server? How do you install plugins? Well, today I will be showing you how to install plugins. So, what you're going to need first is a pocket mine server on your computer or the easier way to get this app, Plug Pocket Mine. You can find it on the App Store. Um, see, look, you just go to the App Store, search Plug Pocket Mine, and it should be right there. <clears throat> it comes up right here plug pocket mine for minecraft p you can have a server with 50 people on this and have use plugins but if you just want a server with four, four people you can get plug for minecraft p it also lets you join player servers and it has commands just like this one and now I'm going to show you how to get plugins for your plug pocket mine server. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. All right, <clears throat> dry third today. Let's go ahead and go to Safari. And what you're going to want to do is go to the search bar and type in pocket mine plug ins. And it should come up with this one. You're just going to click this one, Plugins Pocket Mind Forums. And it's going to have a list of plugins. As you can see, it has a bunch of cool plugins. This isn't even the top plugins. But they have a bunch of really cool plugins here. And all you have to do is say you want a lightning strike. So when a player joins and dies, lightning comes down and hits where they joined or died. And what you're going to want to do is don't click the download button. Even though you want to, don't click the download button. Alright, so you see the name right here? Oops. You see the name right here? Lightning Strike. What you're going to want to do is go to your plug pocket mine. I can't open it right now because it will um, close the recording. Um, there's some kind of thing on Plug PE and Plug Pocket Mine where it won't let you record for some reason. So, I'm just going to go ahead and tell you what you're going to need to do next. I'm going to show you in here. And you're going to want to go into your Plug Pocket Mine server, join the world, and if you're admin, which you automatically are if it's your server, you're going to do this in the chat slash plugins install and then put the plugin name so the name goes right here so lightning strike oh light lighting <laughs> lightning strike and you're gonna class yeah and you're gonna press enter once you press enter, it's going to go and go ahead and say searching repository. Then it's going to say found this many plugins. And then it's going to install the plugin you chose. So, after it installs it, it's automatically activated on your server. You don't need to restart it unless it's a really big plugin. And what you're going to want to do if you have a lot of plugins is do slash plugins. And it'll list all your plugins. But. If you want to update your plugins, you're going to do slash plugins update. That will update all of your plugins at once. And it might lag a bit, not a lot, but just a little when it updates them. But you want the updated version of the plugins because they're awesome. I do have to say, I've tried a lot of, plug of the plugins. They're all really, really OP. But now I'm going to show you, if you install some plugins, they have commands. 
And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to do slash SPP. And then you're going to want to do the group that you want to be able to use them. So if you wanted just random players to be able to use it, you do default. And then you do the command that the plugin added right there. And then you're going to want to do on. And that will go ahead and activate it for default class. And I think that's going to wrap it up for now. If you have any questions, please leave a comment in the chat. I'm going to thank you guys for watching. And hope it all works out for you when you're trying to install plugins. Bye, guys.